Hi everyone, today I will be solving uh, uh, some questions. I have three questions I will solve. So, the, uh, both of them I will be using studio code and a flowchart. So, first generate the, the algorithm with uh, using studio code, then we will now plot the flowchart. So, this will be a very interactive So because I will explain it to you in the sense that next time you have any any question relating to this you on your own you can develop both the pseudo code and the, the flowchart so this is the website i'll be using it is just type draw.io if you like you can just check the type app the diagram.net but just type draw.io it will automatically direct you to this site although i will still put the link in the description so that you can just use it directly so here are the three questions i'll be working on the first is calculate the sum of squares of given input numbers. So what does this mean? This means that any number the user enters, square the number and then save the sum. So it might be five different numbers. So you keep squaring them and summing the numbers. So now, for for just I don't want these videos to be long. So I've generated the pseudo code. So this is just uh, just a. a uh, it's not actually just like an algorithm how you solve the problem so here is so this this program you can't actually just take it to maybe any java or python and just say you want to run it it won't work so it's just uh, algorithm something like code maybe in form of sentences so now why i put this number is just to guide me because it will be in sense of a, a loop so here we once we start the program so this all these steps oh that's what we transfer to our uh, uh, flowchart so the first one is st start we we'll accept the numbers so we we'll check the number if the number is equal to zero we we'll just go to line 60 to automatically jump to this line print the sum and end but if the number is not equal to zero then we will now sum the number if you sum the number then we will take the user back to this input again so you keep entering number uh, until you enter zero so now let's go we'll first start with start and input number so let's draw the chart now let me show you this concept these are the basic symbols this is the arrow the direction of the flow the start and end the if you want to do calculation print accept anything from user and decision so let me go back here here I will start just drag the symbol here this is start uh, let me just reduce it this is start sometimes you can just highlight it uh, ellipse which is start so now we want to accept if you check the our step now is input int x so why are we the input will use this uh, this one so this is input and output if you want to display up accept anything from user this is simple here let me just type here let me just say start here let me just say input input x so here now you need to link everything together so you can just click here and draw arrow here it will automatically link so once we accept the input let's check our next step the next step is we'll check the number if it is equal to zero we jump so what do we make this we we'll use this diamond as decision so i'll put it here so i'll say if x equal zero then go to so if ex equal to zero now so if it is equal to zero let me go here i say this is input and output i'll put it here and i'll drag arrow to it i'll also drag arrow here cool here i'll say print sum so if it is equal to zero which is true this one is true if it is equal to zero this is true uh, uh, 
so if it is equal to zero it will just print but if it is not equal to zero we'll perform an action here so let me process so i'll just let me drag it this side i want it by this side so click here put the arrow so once you put the arrow let's process now say sum equal to x multiplied by x will square the input what the user enters they will now save it so if that is once once the number is not equal to zero so we will now direct sorry yeah once it highlight click and then put it here so we can just drag it so this is how i want it so once we sum it we'll go back ask the user check here so here go to 60 this one will print that's what we did if it is equal to zero print if it is not equal sum the number and go back to input this is what we did here so if it is equal to zero print if it is not equal to zero sum the number keep the sum go back ask the user to enter another number so till the program will stop whenever the user enters uh, a, a number that is equal to zero so here they did not specify either we are to accept three or two or, or just four numbers so the program will, that's why it will be it will be looping so whenever the user enters zero that's when we will print the sum of squares that have generated so this is the solution to this question calculate the sum of squares of giving input of numbers this is the secret code as i explained start this is it here sorry this is start here i will stop the program let me put the stop at the bottom probably reduce the size and then let me always drag from up to down the, the flow should be upside down from up to down so we'll finish and we'll solve this question so you can just save this one please subscribe to this channel for this kind of content so with this you, you should be able to attempt any type of question in relation to flowchart draw it yourself do the algorithm uh, thank you please kindly subscribe to this channel for more of this thank you